Pythagoras was a Greek philosopher and mathematician. He lived around 570 to 495 BC and was known as one of the first pure mathematicians. His most famous discovery is the Pythagorean theorem, which tells us how the side lengths of a right angle triangle are related. Pythagoras was also known as the father of music and harmony. He discovered a relationship between the frequencies of sounds. Harmonious sounds, meaning pleasing or consistent sounds, had frequencies with whole number ratios between them. Dissonant sounds, which were unusual or harsh, had frequencies with non-whole number ratios. An octave is eight notes apart, and if we look at the frequency of note A, it's 440 hertz. The note A, an octave above it, has a frequency of 880 hertz. You can see that an octave has a two to one ratio, since if you multiply 440 by two, you get 880. Now if we look at a perfect fifth, taking the note A again with a frequency of 440 hertz, and the note E five notes above it, E has a frequency of approximately 659 hertz. Now the frequency of E is three halves times as much as the frequency of A. So a perfect fifth has a three to two ratio. Similarly, a perfect fourth has a ratio of four to three, and major third chords have a ratio of five to four. Pythagoras' discovery of harmony has had such an impact. Those four basic sounds form modern music and the harmonies and songs you listen to every day. As you can see, math is everywhere and the discoveries made thousands of years ago have shaped the world today.